Over at the lower chamber, two of the largest political parties in the House of Representatives have thrown their support for Speaker Alan Peter Caetano amid an alleged plot to oust him. Ria Fernandez with the story. Following the House Committee leadership shakeup on Monday, Speaker Alan Peter Cayetano spoke to the biggest parties and coalition of lawmakers in the hopes of ensuring support amid coup rumors. That the NUP is behind him, sinasuportan siya. Yung nationalist na party naman is speaking through Deputy Speaker Abu, supported the si Speaker, and even Lakas. But Cayetano also took a swipe at Marinduque Representative Lord Alan Velasco, who he says refused to probe the multi-billion pesos debt of power generators to the power sector assets and liability management corporation or PISAM. Velasco chairs the House Energy Committee. Bakit ang Committee on uh, Public Accounts at uh, Committee on uh, Good Government ang nag-investiga sa 100 billion utang ng mga power producers sa uh, PISAM? Diba? That's his choice. Eh. He chose to be uh, energy chair, pero ayaw naman niya hearing yung utang sa PISAM. But Velasco opted to remain silent amid the controversies. Huwag tayo magsiraan, huwag tayo magintrigahan, di ba? At huwag, huwag kang matatakot na hindi ka magiging speaker. Kasi kung yan talaga gusto ng presidente, he's the head of our coalition, mangyayari. Meanwhile, the palace distanced itself from the changes happening in the lower house. The president does not really interfere with the intramurals inside Congress. I think whatever controversy it has now, it's being resolved. Panelo also clarified what Cayetano meant when he said that they will heed the president's words when it comes to the term-sharing agreement. He explained that Cayetano said this as a form of respect for the president who helped resolve the speakership battle. For News 5, Ria Fernandez, We Are One News.